Hi there, this is Kenneth Wong, Senior Editor for Desktop Engineering Magazine. Now some of the tasks that you used to do on your desktop and laptop, I'm talking about design review and markups, are very quickly migrating to the lighter, faster tablets. This month marked the releases of two new iPad apps to do just that. IMSI Design's Turbo Review and SolidWorks eDrawings Professional. Now these are commercial versions, so they do have costs associated with them. But both apps have free versions with fewer functions if you'd like to try them out. Turbo Review has quite a rich set of display options with hidden lines, shading, wire meshes and so on. Part of the great thing about the iPad is that it's multi-touch supported, so rotating the models require no mouse, you do it just with your fingertips. Now you can't see my fingertips here on the screen because in order to be able to record my iPad screen, I had projected it onto my PC screen using a software called Air Server. But trust me, my fingers are doing the navigation off screen. Navigation by brainwave is, at least for the moment, not yet possible. The file that we're looking at happens to be a layered DWG file, so you can turn on or turn off certain layers to view separate parts of the assembly. Turbo Review also offers 3D annotation. That is, if you snap your leader's start point, drag it out into an open space and add a note. When you rotate the model again, you'll see that that note is floating in a 3D screen and that that note is always attached to the original reference point. The display is programmed so that the text is always facing you, the viewer, so it won't, for instance, turn upside down just because you tumble the model. You can also add revision clouds and control its look by customizing the line type, color and fill patterns. Turbo Review also supports 3D PDF, so if someone sent you a file like that, you can open up the same file on the iPad and look at it as if it were a 3D model. Once you have emailed that file, of course, it becomes an annotated DWG file available for review on a desktop application. Now, just a few observations. When you try to snap to certain edges and surfaces on your model with your fingertips, it takes some practice to get it right. The software does have auto snap, so pay attention to the crosshair target that appears when you're directly on a snappable point. The text sometimes gets a little too small when you zoom out, but that's something IMSI Design plans to address in an update, I've been told. In some commands, the text option is there, but it's not actually applicable, like if you're trying to draw a revision cloud. Perhaps something IMSI Design would do in the future is to remove that text option altogether from dialog box where it's not applicable. Now let's take a look at SolidWorks eDrawings Professional for the iPad. This is the mobile app version of the popular SolidWorks lightweight file viewer. And like Turbo Review, it gives you markup options too, but eDrawing handles them in a slightly different way. The software saves a view with your comments so that you can see them later by going to the side tab and selecting them. With eDrawing, you get the assembly structure or the hierarchy tree. So you can use that to navigate through the model or turn off certain elements or make some components transparent. eDrawings also have a cross-sectioning option that is very easy to use. You just have to select the direction of the plane, then drag it along the slider bar to see your model in different slices.
the exploded view in the animation view gives you the option to play a model in a certain sequence as if it were a mini movie. Just like the desktop versions of eDrawing, the app for iPad also gives you the option to add dimensions or add measurements. But like snapping in Turbo Review, placing the dimension to exactly on the edge or on a face or at two different points whose distance you're trying to measure is a bit tricky with fingertips, so that might require some practice. Turbo Review is selling for $34.99 at early bird price at the moment, but will eventually sell for $49.99. eDrawing Professional is selling for $4.99. These two apps are just a drop in the bucket, so to speak. There are other viewers available, including ones from Siemens PLM software for Solid Edge, AutoCAD WS from Autodesk, CAD Faster from CAD Faster, and XVL View from Lattice Technology. So check them out. Until next time, this is Kenneth Wong packing up his iPad.